Y'all can ask me a question. You know, if y'all want. I ain't see y'all questions, but y'all gotta ask them first. Are y'all confused about something? I'm open to answer uh, questions that I can't answer. Somebody said how she don't want to talk to her about uh, she called me about seven, eight o'clock. She asked me how I was doing, which is crazy because she the one that got sexually assaulted. But she asked me how I was doing, and how would tell me how the rose was because she was already on her way back home. That's the last time I had talked to her. Nobody gonna ask no questions. Everybody got a lot to say and wanted me to, to tell my story, but nobody asking no questions. I don't think I wouldn't be famous. I'm really irritated for real. I was not there when it happened. Last time I talked to her, she was okay. She was uh, an hour away from home. She was driving home. And she was letting me know that the roads was bad. We did not go to the club together. I do not know the guy that was in the video. I know, but I feel like I need to say a little something. Even though everybody tells me not to say nothing, but. On the video, when I, okay, hold on. I'm trying to answer everybody's question. I'm okay. I Don't worry about me. I'm okay. I'm just, I don't know. I'm all right, though. I'm okay. It didn't happen to me. What happened to her is totally different than me Me getting bashed on Facebook. This ain't, this, this, this just Facebook shit. She actually, something actually happened to her. We didn't go to the club together. What'd you say, it's snow? I'm trying to find it. On the video, it's a video. I never seen the video until after I got back to my room after we even left the club. Whole time I didn't know none of this happened. She all right. She okay. Her Facebook is blocked right now. She get on Facebook tomorrow and tell y'all what's going on. Yeah, I didn't see none of the questions at first. I wasn't there when it happened at the club. 
I get to the club at one some. I text her like, I'm here, where you at? She come over here, dude was following her. Hold on. That was who that pulled, that turned around in the video. I wasn't even in the video. I don't even know. She okay. She's fine. She's blocked on Facebook. She can't respond to nothing. But when she walked over there, she, hey, J-Bug, what's up, what's up? Meantime, I'd never seen the video at this point in time. So I didn't know. I didn't know what was going on. I'm thinking the dude came with her that they was, that they was together. So he come over there and I'm still in my mind, they together, but she, her vibe was real weird. And this is my first time ever hanging with the girl. I know her through Facebook and she came through my White Castle drive through one time and I, I know her for her husband, but I don't, I, I wouldn't call her a friend because I don't know her like that. I just went to the club. And I told her, I had, I saw her that she was in ATL too. We were both from the same city. I'm like, girl, I'm here too. I can't even read all this shit. So, how did you play a part in the incident? Hold on. So, I, um, I told, she, I guess, I can't remember. I think she asked me or I asked her what she was doing tonight. And I told her it was August. I seen the concert. It was 25 bucks to get in. And she was like, oh, okay, I'm going to go to that shit type shit. It's in my inbox. I, it's in my inbox or whatever. I can't even read all this shit. I'm just going to take. And that's how I got involved because she tagged me on Facebook telling me that she already there and blah, blah, blah. And that she was telling me a whole bunch of stuff. I can't even read this shit. But so I told her about the concert or whatever. And she went like at 10 something. I thought I'm not coming to like 1 30 in the morning. So, <sighs> when I got to the club, she was on the other side. Okay, this this is a stage right here. I'm on the right side. She she on the left side. When I first walked in, that's the right side. So me and my my friend that I came to to Atlanta with, we standing right there. And I'm like, let me text her to see where she at. I text her whatever. She said she was. I said she said she's about a stage too. Cause I told her I was about a stage. And she said, what the fuck did she say? It's in my inbox. She said I'm on the. Uh, I told her I'm on the right side. She said she on the left. And I said, okay, I was looking for it. I said, I still don't see you type shit. So then she walked over there with the dude behind her. With the dude behind her, whatever dude. Like, he seemed cool because y'all been hanging out on the live the whole time. I'm thinking y'all was together. That's the only live I seen when they was on the kicking it and stuff. So this by this time, so, uh, this girl texts me. It was like, "Is Jazz okay?" And I'm like, "Yeah, she cool. She right here." I'm thinking that she just ain't answering her phone to nobody, I'm not knowing that it's a video of her getting raped on the internet. Whole time this going on. So I get over there. We 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 made a Snapchat video. I'm like, "Hey, what's up? We kicking it and stuff. We dancing and stuff. Dude dancing all along. I'm thinking that's her nigga, whatever." So she busts. I said, "They tried to rape me," and I'm like, "Who?" Like I keep on saying, "Who?" Five minutes later, she chilling. She grooving again. She's like, I'm cool. Though. I'm cool. They got me together. They helped me out. I'm thinking the dude helped her out. That was behind her. And then I'm like, okay. So it was a twerk contest, like probably 10 minutes later after that. No, before that, before that. Let me get to that part. This dude, he had a drink in his hand. And he was like, first, first, first fucking thing he broke. He said, what the fuck did he say? He said, let your friends get some of this drink. I'm like, no, I don't even drink. No. He was like, uh. And he said, what the fuck did he say? He said, I ain't do nothing to it or nothing. I, I, I don't drink. And she 
could just look at them. Once they couldn't, I don't know. It was just weird. So I let that shit slide. I'm like, okay, I don't know. I'm still thinking it's her nigga. So then after that, it was a twerk contest on stage. She get on stage. She got in the twerk contest. She went to the second round. That's on my Snapchat. She was dancing and shit. So he recorded her, and it was real creepy because of her skirt just kept coming up. He like, yeah, I'm put on world star. I'm put on world star. I'm standing by him the whole time. He just saying weird shit. And I'm like, maybe he didn't come with her. Like, maybe he don't even know her. And then I'm looking at his phone the whole time. He didn't record the girl ass and shit, her stuff, and he put it all over social media and shit. So I'm like, this nigga can't know her, how he disrespected her. So when she get back down there, I'm holding up her and stuff. And she had, uh, had took her shoes off when she got back down there. And then... I just felt creeped out by him, not knowing that he did. He raped a couple couple hours ago. Still don't know this by now. So he fucking he fucking was stealing his phone. He was watching her video over and over and over again. Over again. I don't know this nigga from a can of paint. She didn't even know him. So I finally asked, I said, did you come here with him? She was like, no, j I don't know him. They, they tried to rape me. He said he's saying they. I'm like... Mm, mm -mm. I'm just steady shaking my head. I'm confused. She's still dancing and having a good time. Then she bust out crying again. So now I'm like, okay, something got to be going on. So I asked him, trying to be cool with the biggest fuck. I'm scared as fuck. The last time I talked to Jasmine, this was like at 7, 8 o'clock. She was at home. She's not dead. Who the fuck? Anyways, so she, um, so he was all on her. She was dancing on people and and it's, it was a girl in front of him. She was dancing on his girlfriend. And it just was like, it just looked like they was a little couple. So, finally, I was like, hey, did y'all, trying to be cool, did y'all come here together? And he was like, yeah, yeah. And I'm like, mm, I don't think so. I said, Jazz, did y'all come together? And she was like, no. I said, do you know him? And he was, she was like, no. And then he said, so you want to tell, tell her that you don't know me? And I'm like, what the fuck is going on? I didn't understand it at all. So I'm like, I don't think she know you. And she keep on saying, she keep on saying that uh, that she she got raped by somebody. I said, do you know something about that? He flips the fuck out. He just start going on, bitch, fuck, what the fuck? Why the fuck would I? And, and why the fuck you tell this girl that I raped you? And ain't nobody fucking raped you and fuck you. And he just started going off. And, but he was still standing by us after he didn't cuss us out. So I'm like, fuck. How the fuck I'm finna get away from this nigga? How we both finna get the fuck away from this nigga? Because now I don't know what the fuck is going on. I don't know if... She keep on saying he tried to. So me, I'm just thinking he grabbed us. You know what I'm saying? Grabbed us something. I'm like, I don't know. Still ain't seen the fucking video this whole time. So I fucking... I'm sorry. Uh... So he finally kind of backs up after we didn't argue again. And my friend Caitlin kept on saying, what's going on? What's going on? I had my friend I came with kept asking me what's going on. Because she could see him over me cussing and, and pointing and shit at me. Like, he told me, he going to get me put out this motherfucker. Fuck you. And he told me, bitch, you don't even know her. And I know her for years. And I'm like, you don't know this girl. She don't even fucking live her. He told me, he going to get make sure she get home. I'm like, I'm like, Jay, what is going on? She, it's him, it's him, I'm glad you got it. And then if he walked away, this before August I seen it even came out. We still there chilling. So she um uh, what the fuck she do? He August I seen it finna come out. Dude and walked away. She was like, Thank you so much for getting him away from me. He was he was just tripping and na, 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 and and I'm like, okay, so I'm, I'm thinking we cool, we in the clear. I'm still not knowing he'd already raped the damn girl. So we I'm we chilling, we cool. And then August I seen her come out. She turned up for the uh, concert. And then she was like, Jamie, can you take me to my car? And I'm like, yeah, I'll take you to your car. I'm walking up to her car. We Ubered there. I didn't have, we didn't have our car. We Ubered there. So I'm walking to her car or whatever. And I get in the car with her. That's when I made the other live. I'm like, you need to tell people what's going on because I'm confused too. I said, what video are they talking about? What's going on, Jazz? She bust out crying and stuff. I'm like, you need to calm down and, and explain what's going on. So she... She explained what's going on and we don't know. I don't know the dude name. <laughs> she, I have no idea who the dude is. She don't even know who the dude is. I kept asking her. She don't fucking know. So I 
I don't know how she. I don't. I wasn't there when she was when she when she got sexually assaulted. I was not there. I couldn't tell y'all nothing that happened then. That's why people keep asking me. I I have no idea. I don't know what happened then. And first of all, with my friends with me, if we come in that motherfucker, we there. I don't even fuck with no niggas when I go out of town to clubs. And I go out of town every other weekend. Ain't nothing ever to happen to me like this. Shit. Yeah, we Ubered there. That's why we was Ubering there from the get-go. We was going to the club. I plan on going to this concert two weeks ago. I just told her about this because I know it's on Facebook that she was in Atlanta too. Now, all the assumption that she wasn't, that she wasn't raped, I have no idea about nothing of that. I don't know. I wasn't there. I couldn't tell you what happened. I didn't, I wasn't there in no videos or none. The only video when I got there was one o'clock in the morning when she was cool. We was laughing, kicking it. She was geeked out with her. She was talking to me and the dude. I, I don't know. I don't know if he got her mind gone like that or what the fuck just happened. I know, I know I shouldn't be explaining stuff, but I just want to let y'all know I wasn't even there when it occurred. And that shit would never happen if I was there. Because I don't play that shit niggas all the time. That's how I end up getting him off of her. Dude, you know, I was standing there the whole time trying to figure out how to wet, a way to get her off of him or get him off of her. Because he was on her like that was her motherfucking nigga. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, she she I know her from Facebook and and all that shit, but this was my first time. This is my first time uh I don't know. Yeah, this is my first time hanging out with her. For real, for real. I Uber because I came with another person. She came to Atlanta by herself. I came to Atlanta with my friends that I was with. A boy and a girl. She gonna tell her story. Her page is blocked right now, and I'm y'all only outlet right now because of the, cause her page is blocked. But she gonna get her and tell y'all the same shit. Shit happened. I ain't have nothing to do by, with nobody getting raped, so. Sexy assaulted and continue to party. Love you, cousin. That's why I didn't know that that happened because shit, we here kicking it. And I already talked to the police. This was crazy. We don't know. Nobody even knows who the dude is. It's not... Nobody in no picture that y'all seen with her. She don't know him. Dude told me, this what creeped me the fuck out. Dude told me, told uh, Jazz, give, give your friend some. Give your friend some. I don't drink shit off the no damn body. She ain't buy two tickets. That was my screenshot I sent to her. I had got to, my friend got two tickets. My friend I came with, she bought me and my ticket. That wasn't her, that wasn't her, her um, link. That was me just sending that to her so she can buy her ticket for the concert. Her page being blocked and she cannot post anything for 24 hours because of the video got reported. I do give a fuck about her. Shit.
Do y'all understand that I got this man off of her by cussing him the fuck out and accusing him of raping her? I could have just let him take her home, but I, I'm not that kind of person. He still was on her, like, talking about, I'm going to make sure she get home. And I'm like, she don't even live here. How are you going to make sure she get home? He didn't say get back to her room. That's what That was another trigger. I'm like, nah, this nigga don't even know this girl. Did who see the video? The cops? I don't know. You got to ask Jazz about that part. I just, they asked me for my part of the story and stuff. That's it. Yeah, then nobody know what happened but the girl. All I can tell you is what happened once I got there. Shit, that nigga was so scared. He backed up like, man. Shit. Then he got, I see him get on another bitch, so shh. Love y'all too, man. Right, he posted he posted the video when she was twerking on uh the stage. <laughs> Ain't nobody from play nobody to want to sell somebody for some damn crab legs. Not much money I make. <laughs> it's like, that ain't got shit to do with nothing. She still, she calling me, asking me, am I okay? This was, this was hurt me. She so worried about me and Facebook shit. She not even thinking about herself. That shit petty as fuck. I ain't on, this shit don't bother me. This ain't shit. My loyalty is getting this nigga off of her once I got to the club and realized that he don't even fucking know her. Because I could have just walked about the motherfucker after the concert was over and fuck it. But nah, I'm like, what the fuck is going on? Shit. And you know when you in the motherfucker eyes and the creepy ass nigga all on your, your homegirl, you like, back the fuck up. That's all I thought the situation was. I didn't know that she even got raped two hours before this. And it's not me letting her do anything. This is my first time ever hanging with Jazz. I know her from Facebook. And all this stuff that been going on Facebook, and she came through my drive through where I work at. That's it. This is my first time even hanging with her. I ain't let him take her to no secluded area. I wasn't there when she got raped. Nope, I wasn't around her. Last time I talked to her about seven, eight o'clock, she called and checked on me because the rose was bad. Yeah, I could, I could, if I see him right now, I know exactly what he looked like. His fucking image is burned in my fucking head. They, they ain't even caught the dude. Someone did he go to jail? They don't even know. They don't even know who he is. No one knows who he is. Yeah, I talked to the dude. I did. I didn't know. I didn't ever. This. I watched the video when I got back to my room because I still ain't see the fucking video. I'm thinking she just drunk. I seen the guy. I talked to the guy. He talked to me. She talked to me and him. She was telling him how I'm in, I love Kevin Gates. And I got him tattooed on my chest. Shit, I didn't know what the hell was going on up in there. That shit creeped me out. I wasn't there when she got raped. Because I didn't know she got raped. She just was saying they tried to rape me. And then they, who the fuck is they? I'm not knowing it's this dude that's standing right next to us all in, our, all in her face and shit. I'm thinking she, he helped her get away from the motherfucker. I don't know what the police said to her. I wasn't there when the police, when she talked to the police.
she got my number. I don't. I mean, I don't know where she live at or nothing, but she called me. I don't know. Stay close to her. I was wasn't close to her from the get go. I know it ain't my fault. And she she told me at home how she glad I got there when I got there because she she didn't know a way to get away from him because he kept following her. I don't know who was record, a dude recording next to him. I don't know who dude is. I don't know his name. I purse all wide open. I'm over to tell her, put your shoes back on, get your purse. And I grabbed her by her hip and I put it in front of him. He keep on trying, he kept on trying to wiggle his way in. I'm like, this shit is weird. I'm like, I don't know what's going on. So he raped her and she. No one knows his social media. No one even knows who the dude is. I don't know him. Shit, I know he, they was playing African music. And he sounded like he was African when he was singing the songs and shit. He smelled a little tart. Shit, that's all I know. I'm just thinking he's some nigga that she with. Right, his picture on the fucking live. Spread his picture around. Yeah, he posted the video of her in the contest. He was on the phone staring at the motherfucker for 10 minutes. I'm just trying to feel his vibes the whole time until I finally asked him. Got my nerve up to ask the motherfucker, do we know her? Shit, I'm scared too. I don't know this nigga. And I don't be around niggas I don't know. The video confirmed it. I wasn't there because I wasn't coming to the club till one thirty. She got to the club at ten. I didn't. I didn't come to Atlanta with her. I I told her about a concert that was going on that night. He black, black big ass nose, African smelling. I don't know his social media info. I don't know his name. I don't know him. Yeah, she would talk to him after he raped her. Who got Kevin Gates tattoo? Me. I only hanged out with that was my first time ever hanging out with her. I met her on Facebook. Round the city. Seeing us around. Last time I talked to her about seven o'clock, seven, eight o'clock. I ain't called her since then. She was called to check in on me, which is crazy because she the one who went through the shit. She she worried about me with social media shit. I haven't talked to her since 7 p.m. I haven't seen her since that night. I don't know if he was alone. When he got off of her back, that's when I was relaxed after that. I'm like, okay, he gone. Fuck him. Then she enjoyed herself at the concert. Know it from Facebook. It's a lot of weird niggas that walk up to you in the club. I, I didn't I didn't see the video to know that he raped her the whole time. That motherfucker. She'll get on Facebook tomorrow. Her page is blocked up because they they um 
they report that video so she can't post or comment on nothing until post a comment on anything until uh 24 hours is up I seen his phone posting it. I didn't ever see his name or nothing on Facebook. I just seen him watching the, the girl video over and over again. And he recorded on, I'm going to make her get on World Star. I'm like, nah, you don't know this girl. You disrespecting her like that. She didn't leave with him. I left with her. We canceled our Uber on the way home and got in the car with her. Kate, I don't even want to add you because they're they going to hop on your damn line. My friend that always actually came down there where she, she was there the whole time. I texted when I got there and I asked where she was at. He he brung her over to me. That's just, that's what the argument he was saying. I brung her to you. How the fuck I rape her? It just was too much. Too much. I don't know his Facebook name. Nobody knows who he is. So who were you with if you was with? I came with my friend, my friend Caitlin. She want me to add on her, but I don't want y'all to fuck with her too. Like y'all fucking with me. I need my ass beef for what? For getting a nigga off her when I realized what the fuck was going on. I don't know why the girl stayed around. I didn't even know he raped her until after we got back to the car. And she bust out crying and told me exactly what happened. I don't know where her friends at, but just to think about it. Well, she went to another club that, that nobody even knew she went to. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Everything happened for a reason. And my story ain't changed at all. I just don't even know where the fuck to start it. Right. She she been she she been thanking me all fucking day. She keep calling me to thank me and to ask am I okay. And this what's crazy is Fuck, I did something wrong. What's crazy is I did something wrong. Hold on. Shit. The story weird because it is weird. Shit. I wasn't there when she was getting raped. This was a whole other side of the stage. She wasn't screaming. She wasn't screaming when I, I got there at one. That video said that happened at 11 o'clock. Look how many hours have passed. He did say he ain't rape her. I don't, I don't get what you're trying to say. Ain't nobody lying. You had to be there. Was you there? Shit. 
Now I told this story 17 fucking times. Yeah, she gonna tell the same story. I, mean, I don't know, as long as she okay and it's all that fucking matters. It don't matter what the fuck was going on with me. This shit don't matter to me. This social media. Police already know. They already know. Everything is going down. <laughs> but that's not me for me to tell y'all on Facebook what the fuck the police is gonna do. Fuck. I already talked to her. She been calling me all goddamn day. I already talked to her. She don't want to be talked to. She was already raped before. She was already raped when she said something like that in my video. I didn't even hear that. She was just screaming. But yeah, go to her page when she when she can get back on tomorrow. She'll let you know. She might make a whole fucking video. Who knows? That boy was on her like that was her nigga. I couldn't believe it. Right, trust me, that shit would not have went down. Because I don't like all that all on people and shit while we trying to have a good time. I only let my own man be all on me. I don't give a fuck who believe me. <laughs> the fuck? What do I have to do with me meeting her off of Facebook? First of all, if I never showed up to the damn club, he probably would have took her home somewhere. I know she okay. That's why it ain't. That's why I'm calm and chill. She did come to the club with me. She was there. <laughs> Fuck. I wasn't there when he was pulling out his, his dick the fuck, I guess. I ain't seen none of that. I wonder. I don't know. I wasn't there, Jay. What you mean, Mike? No, she didn't leave because... She ain't leave after she got, I don't know. I can't tell you that part where her head was at.
She took herself to the hospital. She didn't know the dude. It's not her man. I'm at home at the crib. I just got here. We just pulled up. She ain't dead. She, she, all right. This happened damn near 10, 12, 15 hours ago. She's okay. She keeps saying she's okay. And I couldn't make her. Can you hear me? Hold on. Can you hear me? Jamie. Yeah, can you hear me? Yeah, can you hear me? My, I don't know if you can hear me because I'm still on the road. I can hear you. I can hear you. Oh, okay, okay, yeah, okay. You can't see me because I'm driving. The girl is not dead. We keep referring to her as the girl because we just met her. I just met her. Right. And I knew her from around the way. That girl's not dead. Tell your story, Kate. Tell your story, Kate. Man, I'm going to tell you. All right. All I motherfucking know is that we went to the A. We went to the A on our own personal endeavors. Didn't know this girl was going to be there. I've never met this girl a day in my life. So, we driving around the A. Jamie like, oh, my friend here. I'm like, oh, okay. She like, going to tell her to come uh, to the club. I'm like, all right, cool. So, we went to the mall. We got some food, all this and that, blah, blah, blah. So, she tagging Jamie and told her that she getting dressed. We like, all right, cool. Then she tagged Jamie again. She like, the parking is $20. So by that time, when she, when, Jamie, when she told Jamie that the parking was $20, Jamie woke me up, cause I was asleep. And Jamie told her that we just gonna Uber there anyway. So if she's already at the club, we already at the, our hotel telling her we're gonna meet her there. She was already there early as hell. I didn't plan on going to the club until about one because the club closed at three and I knew I wasn't gonna perform until about two. So I'm not going to the club just early as hell just to be in there. We only came to see this motherfucker. I'm not referring to him as a motherfucker, but I'm saying like, we only came to see him. So I'm not finna be in the club standing around early as fuck. It, no, it's not no motherfucking Irene vibes. If we came to the club to see August Alcina. So by the time we get to the club, meet her in the club, she greets us. She like, what's up y'all? Hey, nice to meet you. What's your name? Yada, 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 whatever. So when she greets us, the dude is already still with her. Now I just met her. I'm automatically assuming this is her nigga. This is her dude. So I'm not, you know, I'm not thinking nothing of it. Cause she's in a good mood. She greeting us or whatever. Never said nothing about nothing. All right. So she goes, on stage in a twerk contest she didn't have on no bra no draws nothing still haven't said nothing so this is when it get weird she go on stage she go in the twerk contest so they have the twerk contest it's like three motherfuckers they eliminate one girl so now it's her and the big girl the big girl ended up winning a twerk contest because she hit the split so they just gave the bread to the big girl they gave her a hundred dollar bill the dude recorded the shit of her in the twerk contest. Okay, so I'm just like, okay, that must be her nigga or something, whatever. 
But then he gets a watch in the, the video in the club. Like he didn't just watch it with his own two motherfucking eyes. So that's when we getting weirded out like, why is this motherfucker watching this shit in the middle of the club on the dance floor? Like, who does that? Right. So, you know how you just, like, be looking at somebody and it's like, okay, something ain't right. Like, the, this something is not right. So, Jamie finally asked dude, like, uh, is y'all together? Like, do y'all know each other? Basically, dude just flip out, like, she straight, she fine, like, you know what I'm saying? She cool, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Here, take this drink. I'm not taking a drink from no motherfucking body. I don't even drink. I'm not gonna take a drink from you, nobody in this motherfucker. Period. Don't know you, don't know nobody in here. So, he just flipped out, like, Okay, so how we standing? I got the Uber receipts. Oh God, I got the Uber receipts. On my motherfucking mama, I got the Uber receipts. I don't know how I'm gonna upload. I can't upload on here because I'm live, but on my mama, I got the Uber receipts. So it's me, Jamie, the girl, and the dude is standing behind the girl. So I'm on the other side of Jamie, but I'm looking at dude and he like getting all up in Jamie's face like, uh, don't fucking worry about it. I said she's straight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you, what woo. So I'm like, bro, why is you getting so mad over some pussy? You know what I'm saying? It's 500 bitches in this motherfucking club. And you mad because like we asked you a simple question. Like you getting real defensive. So then... This motherfucker tell us, well, he came in the club with August and he can just have us kicked out. Oh, no, 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 you're not getting me kicked out for the motherfucker I came to see. Irene and Monifa Jr. Oh, my God. I'm talking about a damn receipt. We got all that. So, basically, August come out, perform. We standing through a whole motherfucking concert singing she got videos of him in her phone we having a good time he wasn't there once we told the dude off like bro your ass tweaking like fall back like you don't even know now that we know you don't know this motherfucker get the fuck on like what is you on you watching videos and shit in the club like get the fuck on he go off start talking to a whole other bitch Boom, all come out, standing through the whole concert, singing the songs, recording this motherfucker. Boom, he get off stage. Right after he get off stage, we call our Uber. We like, we finna walk you to your car. We walk her to our car, we get in her car. She turn the car on. And she like, if y'all wouldn't have came, I don't know what would have happened to me. So we like, what are you talking about? We was already coming. We was already in Atlanta. How 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 was it if we would have came? Like, what is, what are you talking about? She was like, cause they tried to rape me. So I'm thinking she just just drunk, really. So Jamie like, well, who tried to rape you? And she like that dude. So I'm just kind of like. The dude, like, the dude you were standing by? And she just, like, just boo-hoo crying, like, just out of breath, just, like, all over the place. And I'm just, like, I'm not understanding, like, I'm just, I'm in the back seat, like, I just don't know what to even say because it's, like, all this stuff has already happened and you telling us now. You telling us now after this, this had happened hours ago. You can look at Snapchat. You can look at our Uber receipts. We didn't get to the club until one o'clock. When we got in the club, it was 109. By the time they checked our tickets, checked our ID, it was 109. 
that's on my Snapchat, all that shit. One on nine. All got on the stage, it was like two. One of my snaps said it was like 2.24 in the morning. By the time we in her car, it's like three. So you just telling us this at three o'clock. At three o'clock. Mind you, we in the club. I don't know who I don't know who I was Mind you, I don't know this girl. I don't even have her as a Facebook friend now. So we didn't see no live. We didn't know nothing about no live. Jamie phone just get to go on, go on, go on. But we in the club. We having a good time. We drove. We came from out of town. So that's when Jamie go live because while well, we in the car with her, because she like, man, it's people on here threatening me, talking to me crazy. Because before she went live, when the incident happened, Jamie was the last person she visibly talked to on Facebook. So of course it's gonna make it look like, you know, we all came together. No, 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 no. I don't even know where the girl came from, where she was staying or what. I was in my hotel room and I fell asleep. Jamie got ready first. So while Jamie was getting ready, I fell asleep. She woke me up and told me that the girl said that the parking was $20. But we knew we was already going Uber because we wasn't even that far away from the, from the club. They said, y'all need to rehearse this some more. Somebody said, can you shut up? But y'all on here, on here threatening us. We took an Uber to the club. We took an Uber to the club. Y'all don't got to explain y'all stuff. You said y'all drove from out of town. What? But five minutes ago, you said y'all had an Uber. That's exactly yeah, what yeah, I'm saying. How am I going to Uber to the club? Town. How am I going to Uber uh, 800 miles away? I don't think that's going to work out. Now you leaving she out of there. Daybuck said she came with them and switched up. She, I met her out there. We did not come with that girl. We brought her there. I don't know where she came from. I don't know. I don't even know the girl. I know where she came from, as in where she was even staying in Atlanta. Right. right. I knew the girl was oh, from St. Louis because okay. she met Jake. She knew Jamie. But where she was staying in Atlanta, I don't know. I didn't know she was even going to come. For real, for real. You know how you tell motherfuckers, oh, okay, well, well, pull up. This is what we'll do. And the girl is not dead. Y'all need to practice how y'all going to tell it to the police. Yeah, shut the fuck up, dude. Already talked about that call the police. They coming anyway. Not for us. What do you mean? on your way there. When is y'all talk to her, she said that and y'all still brushed it off. No, we didn't brush it off. We walked to her to her car, got in her car, and she told us that. But y'all got to understand, we just kicking it with the girl, dancing with the girl. She just in a whole twerk contest. We sat through a whole concert. And then you tell us something like this. Hours after the fact. Like we just had a ball, had a grand old time. Wasn't that was uh, 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 telling us something like that. Her. How was we supposed to, 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 to So first thing we like, we like, we like, are you okay? Cause she, she's irate. She busts out crying and everything. 
We're like, are you okay? She's like, I'm gonna be all right. I'm fine. I'm fine. I mean, we know she physically, like, could still walk and everything because we just was in the club with her. So she just like boohoo crying, boohoo crying. So people get to calling her phone. So Jamie, like, you need to call somebody. You need to let somebody know that you're okay. Mind you, we didn't have no. No knowledge of no lives, videos, nothing. Nothing at all. This is the first time we heard this at 3 o'clock in the morning. And it should have been hours ago. I can't even see why I'm here because I don't even know what it is. Jamie Fall just going up. The first time we had ever heard that is the first time in the morning. So we asking her like, is you okay? You you need some water or something? She said that me and Caitlyn. She said me and her. Said me and her. Me and her. Me and her. I am Jamie. I am Jamie. She ain't up in the open. Somebody said, listen, I know y'all ain't lying. If you go on her page, you can see she's telling the truth. <laughs> Why did they have something to do with it? Cause they didn't want to take it on the Somebody said, yeah, she was dropping her purse. Jamie got her purse the whole time, but it was her birthday. So we think that she just kicking it a little, too, a little too drunk. You know, everybody done been there. My, my initial reaction not going to be, oh, my gosh, she was drugged up. We in the club. We in Atlanta. We all from out of town. Somebody said, wait, hold on. Oh, why they have something to do with it? Because they was enjoying a concert and she was kicking it. Like, what the fuck? Y'all trying to make it they fault. The fuck? Yeah, it's not our fault. If anything, we have... If anything, we helped the girl. I ain't gonna say we saved her, but we helped her the most we could without having any knowledge of any motherfucking thing. All right, I'm, All right, I'm, we saw the dude was still, we saw the dude was still fired. Dude steady watching a video over and over in the club on the dance floor. Then we come to find out, oh, y'all don't even know each other? Okay, you, you, I, I'm weirded out. You, you doing a little bit too much. Yeah. Yeah. Because you just watching it. Like, bro, it just happened. Like, and y'all don't know each other? Okay, you got to move around. He, who the fuck you talking to? Mm-hmm. What? Mm-hmm. I'm talking about all in, all in Jamie's face. So I look over, I'm like, how is you getting, bro, do you know how many females is in here? This is a motherfucking August Alcina concert. It ain't nothing but, but you about the only nigga up in this motherfucker. Right. Right. You so nobody told security is there and they alert the police. So basically y'all went to the club with an associate and then to see her getting on like a damn dog. Nope. We did not. We were not even there when this mm-hmm. happened. And she drives home. She just dropped me. She's why her face is not showing. She's driving back home. The whole the whole right, because I'm driving back home from fucking Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We just got back home. 
they got to get their story together. So why not get her away from him if y'all were suspicious? What did we just fucking say? We well, told we the dude to around. He about ready to punch Jamie in the face. I say, bro, yeah. why are you getting mad over some pussy? Not knowing that he has to think about all of them. And it's the same mother, motherfucker. Right. It's the right. same person. It's the same person. And, and, and you still working on it. Still working on it. You so still lingering around. I can't believe you. I can't believe you. I don't know what's going on right now. This dude is getting away from me. But we want you to get the fuck away from us because you in the middle of the club watching the video. Like, just watching this shit. Like, bro, this shit done been over. Okay, now. Like, y'all didn't think to go. Y'all didn't think to go back in and find his ass after. If somebody up in my motherfucking face, right? First of all, you a nigga. So. If you a nigga getting in a female face talking about some who the fuck is you talking to, all we asked you to do was move around. We didn't ask, right, we didn't, right, we, right. Didn't, right. We, didn't, we didn't ask you, we didn't ask you nothing too uh, outlandish. We just said, get the fuck away from us, basically. And who, who the fuck you talking to? What, why, why are you so mad? Whole time, whole time, whole time, guilty as fuck. <laughs> you guilty as fuck. How you sleep right before you go to the club? Uh, because I had just drove eight hours. <laughs> I got to Atlanta. I got to Atlanta at fucking noon. Got some food. Went to the mall. He was watching the video. He was working on the stage in the costume. And I took a motherfucking power nap. I see. I see. Somebody in the crowd in the crib now. Come on now. Y'all was wrong this time. How was we wrong? I went to the stage when the audio came out. I'm looking at people in his damn phone. He said he watched this fucking video. Yeah, one more minute. I told him, look, I'm gonna get out of here. Like, what the fuck? I'm just thinking he a creepy ass dude. Nigga, we see our homework. 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 Somebody said he should have got y'all ass, too. No, that's real cute. That's real cute. That's cute. First of all, I ain't taking a drink from, from nobody. I don't even motherfucking drink. Right. I don't right. popped on this motherfucker because y'all not finna threat. I mean, y'all on here blaming Jamie. And and want her to to, I mean I don't even know what the fuck y'all want her to do. Y'all y'all want her y'all want it to be her fault and it's not. You know what I'm saying? And I don't even do this shit at all. Period. But y'all not finna like it's making me mad because to see all this bullshit about my motherfucking friend. I got the Uber receipts. Got all that all that shit. Swear they know what happened. If the assault happened at yeah, 11 and then he got there at 1, how could they have prevented? Bro, how could we have prevented any motherfucking thing? If I'm still in the bed at 11 and she telling me that the parking is $20, I'm nowhere near even fucking ready. We got in the Uber around 12 something, didn't get in the club till 109. I think it was about 12.38 when we got in the Uber. 109 when we got in the club. Because a motherfucking girl in front of us was drunk. And they kicked her out the club. Some white girl. They took our IDs. We already had our tickets. So we walked up the stairs and went in. We got in the club. We got by the stage. Close as fuck. I got on Snapchat and made a snap. And it was 109. And that's all my Snapchat. Right now.
but y'all want us to be the bad guys. We wasn't even there. And when we was there, we had no knowledge of anything at all. So what do y'all want us to do? Because what, what, what is there for us to do? Didn't see the video, have any knowledge of a motherfucking live till we got to the room. We get to the room, we instantly see it. We trying to call her, knowing she already probably not gonna answer cause her phone is going up. Her phone is like locking up because people just calling, texting, inboxing nonstop. This is exactly what happened. She brought, he brought her over oh, to and he wore her too. I'm just thinking, she a yeah, nigga. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck going on. If you were close to that letter, and she was perfectly fine. It would take 30 minutes. I, okay, 11.30, 11 minutes. I didn't get there to one to one to one to I said by the time we got in the club, got searched, ID checked, ticket scanned, got in, the, walked up them stairs, got in the club, it was one on nine. It was three motherfuckers ahead of us in line. It was a black girl on the side of us. She was on somebody uh, guest list. Boom, they let her go. Search me, search Jamie. By the time we got in there, it was one on nine. She's speaking because she was there. She, I, I was there. Okay. So Man, he ain't. Was there. So he didn't tell y'all nothing at all and went about her way. Y'all want me to be there? Y'all want me to be there? He did anything to her. Or at least call her and tell her to keep y'all updated. We've spoken to her three times today. Yeah, she's saying the girl. I'm cool. Y'all saying the girl is dead. She's not dead. To our knowledge, she went to the hospital. She got a rape kit done. That's when she informed us that yes, she was indeed drugged. And the last time we spoke to her, we had just left Atlanta. She said she was about two hours away from home. And to be careful, because it was snowing around St. Louis. She don't know his name. How are we going? How am I? I'm going to tell y'all like this. I came to see August Alcina. And, you know, that happened in the midst. And I, I, I don't understand how y'all want me to know the man name. How do y'all want, how do y'all want me to know this man name? How, how was I supposed to know the man name? Nobody knows. Nobody knows. If I knew his name, I would I don't know his name. I don't know. 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 It was already past three. So we yeah, keep so telling her. It's, it's, it's past, it's past three. Like, you know what I'm saying? But like, are you in the water? Do you want to go to the hotel? She's like, no, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. It ain't even that no They left before we left. But again, if you're just telling me this after, you did, sat through a twerk contest, 
sat through a club, sat through a concert. It's just like yeah, she dropped this off at the hotel room. After, after she, we went to the hotel. She dropped it. She dropped it. She I'm not understanding why y'all live. I'm not understanding why y'all inboxing us. Right. Y'all right. was trying to get y'all cake smashed by August. Wow. Hey. What was the alcohol hey. break kit? How, how do how? No, 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 no. She was drunk. No, because the cat is on my bullshit. You don't need to be a detective to see a lie. Hello. That girl was still. We could get over there. I want to make sure she got it. Y'all broke asses couldn't get even get an Uber back. So this was a situation about the Uber back. Soon before we even got out the club, soon as he got off the stage, I called an Uber. We walk her to our car, get in her car. We waiting on the Uber. So the Uber called me on the phone. He say, I'm outside, I'm in a white Nissan. Um, I know on the Uber thing, it say gray, but it's a white Nissan, I'm right outside the club. We like, all right, bet. We get on her car, walk down a little slope to get in the Uber. So we wait about like 40 seconds. I call dude back. He like, uh, y'all, aren't y'all in the car? I'm like, nigga, I'm standing outside. So he like, oh shit, what's y'all name? And the girl said something, he like, my bad. I done picked up the wrong people. Cause I will show you the Uber receipts. My trip was canceled. Because I never got in the Uber because he never came. He picked up the wrong people. Is she Uber or drive? Cause y'all clearly saying two different shit. No, we Uber. This must be getting new friends. Said, she okay, she, she so should have asked their friends to come to Atlanta with her. Right. Where was y'all? Y'all so mad at us. Where was y'all? It was this girl's birthday, and she getting so much love and shit. But nobody came to Atlanta with her for her birthday. I, I'm not understanding. Tell us the worst. She ain't she, she, she at home. She left Atlanta before we left Atlanta. Somebody said, okay, so she was raped, but didn't want to go to the hospital and didn't tell y'all until y'all was getting ready to go. That made me think that she wanted it, but didn't want y'all to judge her, so she just said she was raped. I mean, we Huh? I'm about to get off the line. All right.